Lagos, Nigeria flight is known for us as a high-risk flight. I love working this flight. There are a lot of medicinals that we're picking up. It's just an interesting melting pot of agricultural products. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm very how are you? I'm good. We're going to scan this flight, and we'll see what we have. Do you have any food items in your bags? Yes, I do. What do you have, sweetheart? I have frozen soups. Frozen oh, soups? Yeah, with no meat in <laughs> <laughs> I try to give off positive energy, you know, to the passenger. You've done this before. I've done this before. Uh-huh, you learned your lesson before. Yeah. All right, good to know. They're more receptive to understanding the process. I got a list for you before you start <laughs> You got a list. I love it. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I tried to make it easy for you. Awesome. They're more receptive to wanting to help to not bring anything that's going to potentially harm uh, U.S. agriculture as a whole. We do have a pest that has been found right there. Ooh. The fear is, worst case scenario, an invasive species gets out into the environment they can cause massive destruction to agricultural products or plant products that we have currently here in the U.S. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Any food items in your bag? Yes. Oh, food is here and here. Not what kind of food items do you have? Fish and uh, dairy farming. All right, is that all the food you have? Yes. OK. Once I start going through the bags, if something prohibited is found, you could potentially receive a penalty, a civil penalty, for failure to declare, OK? All right. <laughs> all right, so here we go. Mm -hmm. This is Gari. I have to look through your Gari to make sure. Gari is a form of cassava. And when it comes in bundles like this, we have people that stick other items. So that's what I'm doing now, just inspecting his gari. You said you had gari, you have dry fish. Yes, I had goosey. But you didn't declare this. This is not allowed, sweetheart. Yay! Uh-huh. This is not allowed. Oh. A goosey is a melon seed. And in this form, it's prohibited because of a storage space that we're concerned about. One of them is called capra beetle. Ah, you took that thing out, I will cry. You will cry? Yes. Well, you, I don't want you to cry, but I will be taking it because it's prohibited. Why don't I take it this time and next time I have to blend it? <laughs> no, sugar. I get it. A goosey soup, I know, and it's very delicious. But when entering, I cannot let this pass. Stop looking at it. Let me take it away. All right, so I appreciate you. Have a wonderful day, OK? I try to be very sympathetic, knowing that it's a local hometown tree that is specific to that region. I try to go into it with a heart, but this is what is set forth when it comes to protecting US agriculture. OK, what we got next? Whew. 